Well, now I'd like to show you some of the new things that we have in the thread milling in Feature Cam. Those of you who have been using Feature Cam for some time will know that it was in the past quite difficult to control the approach and uh, retract moves from a thread milling operation. You'll notice that here in version 15 the approach move is directly down the axis of the hole. We then have an arc lead on around the part, an arc lead off and then a retract. But we would still need to control the retract distance to make sure that we didn't gouge the part as we were leaving it. The first enhancement I'm going to show you is something called wind fan. And with wind fan what happens is the tool will approach the part directly down the axis. It then moves out by a distance and then at a specified angle onto the part. Machines around then it leaves off by an arc through the same specified angle back to this point and then the retract move is directly up the axis so we're approaching and retracting directly along the axis of the hole so there is no danger of a gouge on the thread here either on the approach move or the retract move. We've also added in the capability to rough out the thread mill operation. So we can take a series of passes in using a given step over here. So rather than just making a single pass, you'll see now that we can make a series of passes to clear out any material that we want. And finally, if we want a really nice polished thread we can do a number of spring passes and if required we can use a separate finishing tool for this. So in this case I'm going to say do a wind fan approach, rough the part out with a number of passes and finish it using a separate finishing tool with two passes to make sure we get a really nice perfect thread. And there we go.